Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Alan from Premiere Pro Tips, and today I'm going to be going over overlays. Now, what overlays are, are they are, um, they're basically photos, like images, or video that's placed over top of whatever footage you're working with. Um, so I have two examples here. One example is a, like a logo. If you wanted a logo to be um, at the top of your video, like right here. This is one that I made just in Photoshop. It just took me a minute. So what I could do is I just place it on video 2 because video 2 is a layer above video 1 because if it was the opposite, if like let's say I take the overlay and put it underneath it, as you can see it doesn't show up because because the um, it's hidden so you want to make sure that the overlay is on top and um, you want to make sure that you use a PNG file like if you're making it in Photoshop you want to use a PNG file because or else it's gonna take up this whole space like you're gonna have white um, you're gonna have like a white screen that's covering it up what a PNG file does is instead of filling it in with white it's transparent so so all we have is the actual image that we want to be shown up and then in addition to like adding in logos I'm gonna delete that really quick you can also add in video footage that are overlays so right here this is just a video that I got off YouTube it um, you can just go on YouTube just search video overlays and there are a bunch of people who produce these and you can just throw it on top of your video so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna place it on top I'm gonna make it the same um, length as my clip now as you can see you can't see through it which is obviously not what we want um, so what we have to do is we need to go into the effect controls of the overlay make sure that the overlay is selected and make sure that you're not clicked on this instead you're clicked on the overlay you do the drop down for the opacity and then you'll see blending modes blending modes adjust they automatically adjust um, your video so that they can be placed on top of things so it's like specifically for overlays so you can you can experiment with all these um, I'm just gonna quickly go through to see which effect I like I'll just go with this one. This one's called Overlay, which is sort of funny. Um, so I'm just really quickly going to render this. Um, in the meantime, I'm just going to let you guys know that if you have any questions, comments, um, anything that you need help with, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section, or you can um, send me a private message. I'm really good at getting back to people who need help. And so, yeah. Also, um, check out my website. I'll put a link in the description. That's just where I'm going to be keeping all of my v um, videos as well as um, to my YouTube channel. So, um, so you can find my videos both ways. This is taking a little longer than usual to render because it's two video files two video clips I mean so it's a little more complex so it's just taking a little longer but you can really get pretty creative with overlays um, logos are obviously really easy to do and they can make your stuff look more professional and then um, videos can add different effects and like this is just a random um, overlay that I grabbed so it might it probably won't go well with this clip just judging by how it looks now but um, some of it is just uh, experimenting so I'm really quickly gonna play this see it just gives it that sort of that sort of effect so if you like this video if you found it useful 
please remember to like, comment, subscribe, favorite, you know the drill. So thanks for watching guys, this has been Alan with Premier Pro Tips, thanks.